Welcome back to America's favorite post-council show called After the Gavel, where we provide a quick update on the latest city council meeting. Brian Travis, a construction engineer with the Michigan Department of Transportation, kicked off the meeting by providing city council with an update on the I-96 flex route project. They are in year three of this large scale project, and we look for our colleagues at MDOT to wrap up this project this year. Similar to what we saw last year, MDOT will be closing several off ramps again. This year, you will be unable to enter or exit westbound I-96 at Novi and Beck Roads. Unfortunately, the eastbound entrance to I-96 at Beck Road and the southbound M5 ramp to westbound I-96 will be closed for the duration of the project. The good news is that two lanes of traffic in both directions will be maintained. And once the work is finished this fall, the I-96 flex route project will be complete and all lanes and ramps will be reopened. Now this wasn't discussed at the meeting. However, Wixom Road is currently northbound only until fall 2024, as we reconstruct that important thoroughfare. Turning to the business before city council, they awarded a contract to Skolder Construction for the annual concrete joint repair program. This is the work done to the city's concrete streets, repairing the joints in between concrete panels, extending the life of the road. Finally, city council considered a proposal to limit parking in the Howells Lake subdivision. These are narrow roads and some residents in that neighborhood have expressed concerns regarding the vehicles being left on the street. In doing so, possibly inhibiting access from public safety vehicles. Ultimately, council directed staff to return with alternate suggestions to address this issue at hand. That about wraps up everything from the last night's council meeting. As always, check out cityofnovi.org to keep up to the latest and greatest happenings in your Novi. Thank you for watching, take care.